Take a chance, you never know What you don't know is beautiful Hey co-hosts and welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Miss Deja Nicole here. And as you guys can tell by the title, we're doing another unboxing. We're doing another unboxing. We're doing another unboxing. I'm so excited for this video. The last few weeks I've been making um, you know, some pretty steep purchases and investments for my YouTube channel. If you guys caught last week, we went ahead and did an unboxing for my MacBook Pro, my first Mac MacBook I've ever had. And today we're gonna be unboxing a new camera. I went ahead and picked up the Canon M50 um camera i did a whole bunch of research before i purchased it i actually ordered it like two almost three weeks ago then i got it in the mail like a week and a half ago and i'm just now opening it up this is my very first camera you know just like i said with the macbook another milestone another um goal accomplished this was on my little vision board list so i can mark this off too so yeah let's get into it but before we move any further with the unboxing, if you guys haven't already, you know what I'm about to say. Make sure you go ahead and click that subscribe button, you know. I'm just a girl that loves God, makeup, and a bunch of other stuff. So if you guys want to be a part of this journey with me, definitely go ahead and click that button. Make sure you guys give this video a big thumbs up as well. And turn on your post notifications so you can be notified when I upload next. Okay, now let's get into it. Okay, so like I said in the beginning, I did pick up the Canon M50. So this, I got it from Best Buy, and I actually got the video um, creator kit. So it comes with the body of the camera, the lens, a mic, and an SD card. So I believe if you just purchase um, the camera by itself, it really just comes with the body and the lens. You don't get all that other stuff with it. You gotta purchase it separately. So I thought this was the best for me. I don't remember the exact price off the top of my head but i'll leave it somewhere in the video but i believe there was only like a 50 dollar difference if you just got the body of the camera itself versus if you got the um video creator kit so i thought hey why not it's a better investment might as well get this so let's go ahead and get in a whole different frame so i can show you guys the unboxing all right y'all so here it is you guys have seen the box 50 million times i got my handy dandies here just to get this part open okay here we are okay so as i said when you get the video creator kit it does come with a um sd card this is just the standard the smallest um size the 32 gigabytes okay so the first thing is the mic it did come with the rope mic which is very popular when it comes to filming and stuff this mic is very very popular it's supposed to be one of the best out there um i'm just going to use this one from when i'm filming like at home i'm going to buy a smaller one to attach to the camera when i'm vlogging and i'm outside because i feel like this is just like way too big and i feel like it's gonna be mad noticeable and then i am going to get a dead cat which is the thing that you just put over the physical mic to just block out if it's like windy and stuff like that you can still hear yourself and not hear all of the wind so here it is this is the camera the box for it you know you got the description you got your barcode and this is the lens that it comes with i'm so excited okay so let's open this up okay so it's looking like first you have your warranty for the camera um that came with canon i did get the best buy the like geek squat protection too but you do get a physical warranty that comes with the camera itself and then you have your user's guide the manual which is going to be very helpful for me because i've never ever had a camera before this will probably be the only time i actually read a manual out of something that i purchased because i need to know what's going on with it and now we're getting into the camera okay so you have your strap it's just um a canning wrist strap it's not the neck one which i probably will buy the neck one because i feel like that would be helpful when it's time to be out and vlogging but you just have your you know your standard canon design wrist strap you have your standard canon battery and then you have the standard canon battery um charger the charger pack now this one is just for if you have it's just for one camera i was trying to find the one that comes with um the outlets for like two batteries just so I can like at night or stuff I could be charging both of my batteries at the same time I was looking for the charger cord but this is it, it's cool you just flip it up so I'm actually about to go put this battery on the charger now because I was watching a lot of people other unboxing videos and the battery wasn't charged at all so they really couldn't film right away so I'm gonna put this on the charger really quick so this is the camera it's so nice it's a lot smaller than a DSLR this is a mirrorless camera and then they have the grippy part 
on the side because this is where you're really going to be holding it and then they have it on the back on their flip screen as well so this was a plus for me that it comes with a flip screen so you know when you're recording by yourself you need to be able to see if you're in frame and what's going on so if you're like recording something else it'll show like the normal way you know if you're looking through something but then if you're recording you and you want to see it you can flip it and you can see yourself so that was definitely a plus for me because i feel like myself and i need to see what's going on okay y'all so the battery is on the um on the charger so we can get some juice before i start trying to film with it to see the difference um but isn't she so cute she's so lovely um so i'm so so excited about this is super lightweight it's not heavy at all so again it'll be perfect if i'm just at home doing videos or if i want to take it out on the go and vlog it does come with a little screw at the bottom so i can attach my um tripod my selfie stick whatever um to the bottom of it to vlog or if i want to carry it in my hand it does have this grippy part like i said before so it makes it really really easy to just hold i'm sitting here over here talking about the camera and i ain't even opened up the lens hold on y'all okay y'all then this is the lens this is the lens that came with the camera but again it is interchangeable so you can switch it out um this is the let's see if i can find i forgot where it is oh um, so this is the 15 through 45 milliliter arm um, lens and it has image stabilization to it the only thing about the m50 and the lens is that you can change lenses lenses but because this isn't a dslr camera there's only a certain amount of lenses that you can use with it but the plus side of it is you can always buy an adapter a canon adapter which um so the adapter would just help it's universal to all all lenses you know no matter what so you just put the adapter on here first and then you can attach any type of lens to it itself but if you're just strictly trying to take a lens to attach it to the m50 there's only a certain amount of lenses that you can use so let's go ahead and put the lens on um so you just unscrew you unscrew that and it comes off and then you just take it wait i could be wrong first you want to make sure that that is lined up so you can screw it in and bam oh there you go when you hear that click that's how you know it, that it is locked and then let's go ahead and take the cover off and there we are let's actually record and see what's going on Okay, so this is just on my phone right now. Let's flip it over to me. Okay, so it is dark time. It's dark time. It is like night right now, so it's like dark. Let me cut on another light because I just literally have the light from my ring light. And let's see the difference so definitely is I want to say a lot brighter as far as like, the color is definitely different from on the camera versus on the phone this is really um I feel like I'm looking hmm. okay so first of all I need to play around with these settings because this is these are the settings like straight out of the box i need to play around with the settings and figure, figure out what works best for me settings are super super important because if you don't change the settings and don't figure out what works best for you and your setup and stuff like that you can feel like the video quality is off and it's the camera when it's not like settings make a difference so this is just what it is straight out of the camera it's not bad it is super super clear definitely as far as like zoom maybe let's try and change How do I do this? Oh Lord. Okay, so that's, oh, that's zoomed in. I don't wanna zoom, I wanna zoom out. Okay, so this is the farthest that it goes as far as like zoom when it comes to if I'm vlogging myself 
I mean, which is not bad. I really don't need like a big old like super background, but again, it all depends on the millimeter of the lens. So if I had like a wider, um, like a larger number, if it was like at a hundred or something, it'll probably get like more of like this maybe, but it's perfect, perfectly fine to have for vlogging just to have this angle and shot right here. One thing I'm going to have to get used to is looking at myself from the side. So the viewfinder is on the side and not up top. When it's up top, it's a lot more like unnoticeable if I could look at myself or whoever versus it is on the side because you could obviously see my eyes is shifting. So that's one thing I'm going to have to get used to. Um, it is super, super clear though as far as like my skin. Let's see if it's going to focus. It's supposed to have autofocus too. Which, okay. I have to set all this stuff. This is supposed to have good autofocus. Not like crazy, crazy good, but it's supposed to have like good autofocus. So we're definitely going to have to play around with these settings a bit before I'd be like, oh no, or oh yay. Um, but as far as all of the other videos that I watched, they were super, super good. Um, the quality and everything was amazing. It's definitely going to be a lot different than your phone. Your phone camera is very different than a camera camera. My only thing right now that I'm really like noticing is the like richness and the colors. If you guys can tell, I feel like I look a lot more warm tone. The colors are probably a little bit more pigmented versus on the camera. Everything is like light, but I'm pretty sure it has something to do with the settings. So again, like I said, I'm going to play with around with the settings and stuff and figure out what works for me. Okay. Y'all. So that is pretty much it as far as like me testing the camera itself. I'm um, again off rip. It's kind of just like. I don't know how to feel right away um, just because I know I have to play around with the settings and kind of get things to how I like it. So maybe I'll do like an updated video once I get um, the camera and like the aperture and all that other stuff to where I want it to be to get the quality of the video how I want it and how I see it for others. Then I'll probably do an updated video. This is definitely going to take some learning and getting used to. I'm going to have to play around with it so I'm probably not going to start making videos off the back with it i'm probably gonna still stick to my iphone until i feel comfortable and get everything how i want it to be on the camera so i did actually pick up a case for the um camera a carrying case i got it from best buy as well just something so when i'm out and about or from traveling and doing other things the camera can have a place and have a home to stay so it doesn't get um scratched up it's a I'm able to separate it so I can take the lens off or leave the lens on if I want. But that'll be how um, that case is how I'm going to be storing my camera, whether I'm home or traveling or whatever. And then I did get an actual like case for the physical body of the camera that I go over it just so you know the physical body of the camera doesn't get any scratches or anything it kind of helps stay where it needs um it kind of just helps stay in like that perfect nice condition but guys thank you so much for tuning into this video I'm really excited to see you know what I can do with the camera and how it kind of just like help take my um channel to the next level and you know as far as like quality and stuff like that I'm excited to use it and there's a lot more events than just clicking record on your iPhone um but you know hey we growing we getting bigger we getting better so that's just a perfect and great investment so but thank you so much for tuning in guys if you have not already go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up again subscribe to my channel I'm just a girl that love God makeup and a bunch of other stuff and turn on your post notification so you can be notified when I upload next. All right, y'all. I'll see you on my next video. Peace. Take a chance, you never know. But you don't know it's beautiful.